Okay, if you're Redmi Note 8 user and looking to install Android 12 on your device, try out this Pixel OS. This is the official Pixel OS which we have installed on our Redmi Note 8 and it is based on Android 12 of course, but with the latest security patch of December 2021. Yes, January 2022 is going on. December 2021 security patch is there. Quick Silver kernel is what you get pre-installed. Pixel OS is a, actually a, one of the very good choices for you to use it on a device if you're looking to install Android 12, it's official version. It's quite stable of course, a lot of things, a lot of bugs have been fixed in this one. So I think so, you need to try out this thing if you're looking to install Android 12. Arrow OS is quite stable and this might be one of the stable custom rooms out there and I'll tell you why I have interesting thing available for you. This room, this build include a very interesting thing which was quite awaited basically and if you want to add or remove tiles you can by just simply one click and also including that we have a web wi-fi and mobile data separate tiles available for you which is quite helpful of course all the things are present here if you move on to the default launcher etc as i don't think so you need to talk about anything because it is pixel os so yes pixel launcher is what you get pre-installed the stability and performance seems to be decent enough stability is good and in the terms of performance or multitasking it was expected this type of things were expected and it's good it's quite smooth not smoothest so far but it's smooth enough to use as your daily driver i think so google assistant is also included if you want to give it a try you can and if you want to check out the hey google i'm not sure but from swipe up from the left bottom or swipe up from the right bottom those things were working for perfectly fine this is what I wanted to show you as if you were looking for MIUI camera, it's included, it's finally included, MIUI camera is already included in this version, even though the photo mode, portrait mode, everything is working. Sometimes if it is stuck there, what you need to do is just simply swipe up or basically just move on to the recent apps, clear this app once, move on to the camera section once again, and you'll be able to use the portrait mode or any other mode if you want to. At first it was like that, but after that there might be not be any kind of issues for you as you can see night side panorama pro mode yes in android version 12 you are having you are having the MIUI camera pre-installed 48 megapixel etc but if you're looking for an anx camera or if you need anx camera unfortunately that is not available for android 12 yet but to get that or if you are looking for that make sure to subscribe the channel i will make a video that whenever anx camera will be available for you which should be supported with android version 12 but right now it's not so just if you are user of redmi note 8 you can use the MIUI camera that is something good including that if you want to check out some other things for example the pixel launcher is kind of from android version 12 the switches etc from android 12 it has all the things which you need almost all the things in my case l3 is there which means l1 is not there maybe you need to install firmware to get l1 back but i'm not sure as i don't use netflix or amazon prime at all but if you use it make sure to try out the latest firmware for your device and then you might get the l1 certificate including that another interesting thing about this one is if you move on to the google photos app you'll be able to see you get unlimited free storage for full resolution photos and videos uploaded from your pixel device if you want to give it a try you can i think so it's quite good you can change this at any time in settings and i think so it's quite good that you have the unlimited google photos unlimited full resolution google photo storage and videos uploaded from your pixel device it's quite helpful of course i always use this thing and you get this pre-installed moving on to the other options for example settings you can see network and internet apps let me show you one thing you have the gaming dashboard which means game settings are available here for you which is of course quite useful for a lot of users if you want to use it you can but i don't play games so yes it's kind of useless for me too assistant etc is available there wallpapers and style also as the pixel launcher monitor theming everything whatever you need in android version 12 is already present it's already included i think so you like this i think so you love this you will able to you'll be able to use this thing on your device if you move on to the security app of course no face unlock but the device is encrypted which means if you were looking for the non-encryption things or not encrypted things unfortunately it's encrypted so recovery will not be able to access the internal storage xiaomi parts is also included in this build so yes i think so me sound enhancer is the feature which i always use and a lot of users use that Everything else is the same, you have some gestures, etc, advanced restart and everything else I've already shown you. Link is in the description, goodbye.
over the edge Feel like I'm floating through the air